Hello friends, welcome to C Programming Tutorials. In this class, we are going to learn about conditional expression. So, we are called as a ternary expression. Ternary conditional expression. C provides a convenient alternative to the traditional if-else. So, what is the purpose of the if-else? If-else is a two-way selection. If condition is true, you are going to execute true block. Otherwise, you are going to execute else block. For two-way selection, the ternary conditional expression. That means, instead of if-else, you are going to use the ternary conditional expression. So, what is the ternary conditional expression? It has three operands and two token operators. So, how many operands? Three operands. So, one, two, three operands. And a two token operators. Here you are going to use two operators. Okay. So, these three are the operands. So, these two are the operators. Each operand is an expression. So, these one, two, three are the expressions. The question mark separates the first two expressions. The question mark, this is the question mark operator. This separates these two expressions. This is the one expression. This is another expression. The colon separates the last two expressions. That means the colon separates these two expressions, two and three. The syntax is you are going to write one expression. So after that, question mark, expression 1, colon, expression 2. This question mark, colon, we call as a ternary conditional operator. Example, so this is the one expression, a greater than b. Say so greater than b returns for, it returns either true or false. If it is true, the result is a. If it is false, the result is B. Okay. Now, we see the example. So, previous class, we write a program to find biggest of two numbers. Same program here. So, int a comma b, you are going to take two variables. Enter any two numbers. You enter, for example, 20, 15. So, now, int big, you are taking one variable. Here, what is the a value? 20 greater than 15. So, 20 greater than 15, it returns true or false? True. So, A is written and it is assigned to big. If I enter 20, 150, in this case, 20 greater than 150, so it returns false. So, the B is written and it is assigned to big. Okay. So, in this case, so 20, 15, so A is assigned to big. So, in big, the value 20 is stored. Now you are going to print 20 is big. Okay. I hope you all understand the ternary operator. Question mark and column. So this is very important regarding get exam also. So now we are going to see so ternary operator. Here this is the ternary operator. Question mark column. Now we see the execution of this program. GCC program 15.c. Okay, enter any two numbers and 10, 20, 10. So 20 is big. If I give 20, 40, so 40 is big. Here we replace if else with ternary operator. 